Hello and welcome to White Glove Reviews. In this video, we're going to take a look at the Zebra F301 ballpoint pens. And these pens, you can find them in packs of four. And I think the pack, this pack of four was under $10 on Amazon. I'll include a link in the description down below. And these are supposed to be extra tough, extra hardy pens. And so for $250 a pen, if they write pretty good, they might not be a bad choice. So let's open these things up and take a look. I was looking around. I think the only way you get a green or a red refill is in these pens, but I'm not positive. If I missed somewhere, uh, let me know in a comment if there's somewhere to pick up the, the green and the red refills besides these specific pens. All right, let's take a look at these. All right, so see mm, they feel not too bad there's they're not a they don't they're not a hundred percent stainless steel this part's plastic and this part's plastic they're not uncomfortable to handle though all right so let's try this out so this is a zebra and this is a 301 and this one is black. Yeah, it doesn't write too bad. I don't like it as much as the Monteverde uh, refills for the jotters, but it's not bad. Let's try blue. So we got blue and hmm, not bad. Red. The red's not a bad color. And green. Green is always one of those ones I kind of feel that I tend to like a more vibrant green. This isn't bad green-wise. It's not quite as bright as I like a green, but it's it's not like a too dark green. This is maybe like a, a tiny bit dark green. I don't know if it's possible. Let me see. Uh, okay, they don't write too bad. Uh, they're not my favorite writing pens, but again, for ten dollars for a set of four of them, you can kind of buy a little bit of forgiveness with that. Well, let's open these up and take a look at them. See how they open up first of all. Ah, okay, the yeah, unscrew here. So this part is most definitely plastic. Yeah. So this part is plastic. This part's stainless steel, I'm assuming. And then this part right here is stainless steel, and you have more plastic. And looks like a not too terribly unusual refill. This is Zebra F 0.7. So, pretty standard Zebra refill, I guess. So, anyway. I kind of think zebra pens is going to get a strike against them because their stainless steel pens are obviously plastic and obviously plastic so if they're advertising a stainless steel pen I would like the entire body to be stainless steel anyway I'll include a link in the description if you want to check these out if you have had these and you love them or hate them or if there's anything you'd like to see me talk about, just leave a comment. And if you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Thank you, and I hope you have an excellent day.